boys and girls welcome back to my channel if you are new here you are very much welcome i am namtsabo the poet utonda wezizip utondonga nana sentende nemkhondi yahlala sona nesimo nomuntu sona umhlamba wezinyamazane ngimbulaze lizwe umuntu lemnye ngendaba i am umzinkazi kamashobane so please do join the family subscribe and hit the bell button so you don't have to miss any video from me okay yeah okay so you guys today i am going to show you how to stretch your natural hair without using it. just wool it's not even that much of wool it's just this you know okay i think the, the the amount of wool it depends on how many knots you want to make or braids kind of you want to make so for me it is going to be like around like 16 or so called I'm like one 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 anyways you'll we'll see so this is like my hair I have washed it and you know did all the things that needed to be done to the hair so yeah so this is like my hair you guys it is right at the moment that is why I am going to be using this uh, black castor oil and this live in conditioner you know me i am an afri true supporter or i don't know user so i use afri true products for my hair that's why i'm going to be using this live in conditioner and if you want to know the other products that i use you guys make sure that you watch this video up here or here but yeah somewhere there so yeah you guys let's get down to it i will first just moisturize water is very important your hair needs water hair loves water you know feed your hair you know don't make it this don't make it you know need water and it will be like so dry and so breaking and like uh so make sure that you hydrate what you get me okay let's get down to it oh yeah you guys today's shout out goes to tinafe uh she's a makeup artist like you guys yo she's so good so her channel is about beauty obviously makeup and she'll be there posting tutorials and all that so if you want to know how to do the things that needs to be done to the face for it to glow tinafe's channel is for you to check out and you guys you should also follow her on insta i'll put the link in the description below make sure that you follow her subscribe like and comment and share obviously share her content because she's very very good and her quality is like super super top and she's got the vibe like the vibe like watch me watch me watch me watch me watch me watch me watch me, watch me. so you guys please do do the things that needs to be done okay yeah You know, I think I once said this before, helping each other and supporting each other is the one thing that's going to help us grow as YouTubers. Like seriously, you just can't do it alone unless obviously you are some celebrity and you can just wake up one morning, post a video and boom, it has millions of viewers. But for us, <laughs> you know, man, I, you know, it's a struggle. It's a struggle, seriously. And yeah, it's hard. Anyways, with that being said, uh, you guys, if you are a new YouTuber or you are new to this game or you are just small, just like most of us, and you need a shout out, be it here on YouTube or Instagram, girl or oh boy i am here to help you with that just check the description box below and get yourself a, a shout out and i must say that it's not a guarantee that just because i gave you the shout out it, you are going to gain like a lot of subscribers it may be one or two you know and obviously it also goes down on your channel and your content is it good is it okay and do people like it but I think it is worth, it is something worth trying and I am your person. I am volunteering to help you with that. Obviously, you've got to help me back. So yeah, do check the description box below and follow any of the steps there and get yourself a shout out on my next video. I'll be picking people randomly. Yeah.
okay finally we are done we are done we are done so this is how it looks mm -hmm. i'm some typical <laughs> nigerian girl like you know those movies in the uh uh where the girl is like in the village and you know going to marry the prince <laughs> Yeah, anyways, you guys, this is how it looks. You're supposed to stay with it until maybe the hair is dry. Uh, like, because I was using water and the leave-in conditioner and the oil until it is just dry. Like, not like dry, but you know, not like wet wet. So, yeah, and then you have to remove. But I will show you guys how it's going to come out. Looks, I like it. I kind of like it. So, I think I'm just going to add some beads. Like maybe twist, make something like you know zigzags to go back because tomorrow I'm going out. You know, I need to look kind of cute. So I have stayed with this for. For quite some time now and it is time to remove the wool and see how it is going to be you know i don't know i just hope the hair will be out stretched and all that stuff so yeah let's get down to it and see yeah we're finally done so this is how it came out it is pretty much stretched and i like how it came out this is the method i use to stretch my hair like i never ever ever use heat on my hair you know us team natural we don't use heat we don't destroy our hair with just simple things you know <laughs> no silk press nothing just the natural way so yeah you guys i would like to know which ways or which method or whatever kind of way do you use to stretch your hair without really using heat i would really 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 like to try other different ways and yeah let's just pause like that <laughs> oh my goodness that's it from me you guys thank you so much for your time thank you for watching i really really appreciate you all your support means a lot see you on my next video bye